arrested on Tuesday following the alleged rape that occurred after a card game the firefighter hosted at his telephone home. Kenetta posted $10,000 cash bail and was also released on a $15,000 personal recognizance bond. Guam Fire Department spokesperson Lt. Ed Artero says Kenetta asked to be placed on annual leave for an indefinite period to deal with his criminal case. While previous arrests of fire department personnel resulted in internal investigations, Artero says the matter is not under investigation because Kanata is still going through the justice system. He says the fire chief will wait until the matter is adjudicated before deciding then if actions should be taken against the firefighter. The spokesperson adding that the department's internal affairs unit is tasked solely to deal with cases involving personnel accused of violating standard operating procedures and department rules and regs. Kanata's attorney Curtis Vandeveld, meanwhile, says he is gathering statements from other individuals that will show that his client was never at the location of the alleged rape. Vandeveld adding that Kanata denies that the sexual assault happened and claims the female minor is making up the incident. A preliminary hearing is scheduled for June 8th unless an indictment is handed down before then. Kanata is a firefighter too assigned to the Umatic Fire Station. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Nick Delgado.